I am Fozu Kader from East Coast University. And and I am Mustafa Rahman from East Coast University. And this is M K Mohsul Karmain from East Coast University. Uh, we are in Kigao, Chowdhury Para, in front of downtown Kete for our presentation. Uh, you can look at the view. The view. Uh, you can see the place is very neat and clean. And uh, you can also see that uh, their entrance is very good uh, with some cloud top, and uh, it's very uh, good for the introduction of the of a cafe. And uh, so we are here uh, to, uh, for our presentation. So let's let's go inside. Hello again. Now I'm in Kaltong Cafe. I'm Mr. Mr. Rohan. You can see they have nice decoration. This is the logo. This logo of the Adam Cafe. And you can see the color combination of wall and interior decoration. On the other side, you can see uh, their. Okay. Uh, here you, are, uh, you see that uh, the lighting, their uh, uh, marble, uh, granite part, uh, stones uh, decoration, and their uh, upper and uh, lower part of the uh, cafe. It's actually very much attractive to a customer when he enters into, into the restaurant and you see the interior side. Uh, this is uh, actually uh, this is so much attractive to eat. Um, um, it can attract any customer anywhere, anywhere, anytime. So that's it. Thank Here I'm so going much. to talk with uh, two customers. Uh, I'm going to take a review from them. Okay, uh, yeah. If I'm down there in one word, thank you. Uh, for your birthday party or any kind of celebration, uh, will you choose downtown uh, as a first choice? Um, it depends. What will be the situation? But uh, it can be uh, a choice from one to five. Uh, is there any gap between the service and your expectation of this? Uh, no, I can think so. They are up to number. Uh, except the meal, is there any factors they should consider, like price or decoration or interior? Maybe. Uh, that, uh, if I make a quality cost projection, they are quite okay. Uh, suppose uh, their service is very poor. Suppose, uh, but their food quality is very uh, food is very delicious and their food quality is also good. Uh, will you come to this place only to take the food? Uh, perhaps for one of the specific items. I want you to grade uh, this restaurant, downtown restaurant, up to five. Then, what's your opinion? What is the grading system? One is best or no, no, five, five is best? Five is best. Yeah, yeah. Okay, then uh, you have four point five. Thank you. Thanks. Thanks. I am now taking a uh, short interview of uh, this downtown campus manager. So, where I'm going? Do you think that customers are satisfied with your service? Okay, but you cannot expect 100% of the customers. Yeah, exactly. So, there is some reason down Yeah. So, our next question is actually uh, during your peak hour, uh, we know that your uh, very customers are actually coming very frequently here. And it may be very tough to manage themselves. So, what is your initiative in that situation? See, that's what you want. According to your speech, uh, I'd like to ask you what is your first priority? Uh, service or?
thing they can do. Most important thing. And then, um, the service. Yes. Make your service people. Um, dedicated. Is that everything about your uh, quality of food uh, and service or anything else? Actually, food quality, food service, and the ingredients. These all three things um, takes you back. And the rest of the thing that you do to make your customer surprise with a gift or something, that's a different thing. But those three things are the main things, the main focus point. So, we give our best to those three things. And after that, if there is an occasion for the customer, like they have a birthday or a marriage day celebration, we'll try to do something from ourselves which comes out as a surprise. That's it. Thank you so much. For it was nice meeting you. Thank you very much. Thank you.